Welcome to ReplacementLaptopKeys.com. In this video, we will show you how to remove and install a regular ABC size key. From the bottom corner underneath the keycap, release it from the hinge by pulling upwards. To remove the hinge, apply pressure on the top left corner of the hinge diagonally to the bottom right corner. Insert the screwdriver and slide it underneath towards the bottom right hinge to release the mount and do the same for the bottom left mount. This should release the pressure from the two top inner hinges so that you will be able to slide it from under the remaining two top mounts. The reason why it's important to remove the bottom mounts first is to not damage the tabs on either side of the top inner hinge that slide underneath the top mounts. Before installing the hinge, there are two ways to know that the hinge is correct side up. One, the bottoms of the outer hinge will lay flat against the keyboard. And two, when you tap down on the top of the inner hinge, the bottom will flip upwards. To install the hinge, align the two upper tabs of the inner hinge by hooking them under the upper mounting points. Once the tabs of the inner hinge are hooked into the upper mounting points, place your finger on the top of the hinge and slowly push downwards towards the bottom until the hinge is secured in place. Before reinstalling the keycap, make sure that all tabs are intact and not bent for it to be reinstalled correctly. Center the keycap over the hinge. Once aligned, push down and it should snap into place. In this video, we'll show you how to install a small keycap. To install the hinge, there are two ways to know that the hinge is correct side up. One, the bottoms of the outer hinge will lay flat against the keyboard. And two, when you tap down on the top of the inner hinge, the bottom will flip upwards. Now, align the two upper tabs of the inner hinge by hooking them under the top mounts. Once the tabs are hooked into the top mounts, place your finger on the top of the hinge and slowly push downwards to the bottom until the hinge is secured in place. Before reinstalling the keycap, make sure that all tabs are intact and not bent for it to be reinstalled correctly. Now match the tabs on the keycap to the correct placement on the hinge to ensure that it is installed right side up. Center the keycap over the hinge and once aligned, push down and you should hear it click into place. In this video, we will show you how to install a large keycap. When installing the hinge, there are three things to ensure that the hinge will fit correctly. First, the bottoms of the hinge should lay flat against the keyboard. Second, the top inner hinges should also lay flat against the keyboard. And third, when you tap down on the back of the inner hinge, the front will flip upwards. Next, we will align the hinge with the two upper mounting points. Place your finger on the top of the hinge and slowly push downwards to the bottom until the mounting points are secured in place. Now do the same for the second hinge.
To install the stabilizer bar, insert one side into the hole and proceed to insert the opposite side. Before reinstalling the keycap, make sure that all tabs are intact and not bent for it to be reinstalled correctly. Now center the keycap over the two hinges and once aligned, push down and you should hear it click into place. Please give us a thumbs up if you thought the video was helpful, or comment below on what you'd like to see more videos of. If you need to purchase a replacement key, please visit replacementlaptopkeys.com or click on the link below. Thanks for watching.